Now, your news on the go. All right, new today, a survey sent out by the Syracuse City School District. More than 4,000 district employees will give their personal opinion about delaying the return to the classroom. This follows a vote by the Syracuse Teachers Association to request a delay of in-person learning. Now, Governor Andrew Cuomo adding two states to the tri-state travel advisory. That's Alaska and Delaware. No states have been removed, making a total of 35 different states on that list. Anyone traveling to New York from those states needs to quarantine for 14 days. You can find the full list on our website. And new projections are showing Syracuse will be hit harder financially by the pandemic than almost every other city in the country. The only exceptions are Rochester and Buffalo. The projection has Syracuse losing nearly 20% of its operating budget compared to the revenue in years past. And after parents expressed concerns about returning to in-person instruction, the Auburn City School District says they will begin the semester online as they finalize details about safely reopening. The news was announced by the district superintendent last night during a school board meeting.